I hate people today. And in the current state of mind that I'm in, I have no faith in humanity. And that's really sad. For me, to not think of humanity being the best thing out there is sad. After not being able to sleep last night, I finally got to sleep at about 5.15. I was promptly woke up at around 8.15, 8.30 by two people that sounded like two elephants were loose in my kitchen. Understandably, they were going on a trip. They were excited for Cancun. I get that. I understand that. But you still need to be thoughtful of people in the house that are trying to sleep. So after going back to sleep for another 15 minutes, being woke up again because they had to return, I woke up with the biggest throbbing headache. Which anybody that knows me knows. I don't get headaches. Then I look at the clock and I see what time it is and I realize that one of my co-workers is supposed to be over at my house. He normally gets off at 11.30, so I might as well just stay up because, you know, I'm already lack of sleep, I'm already in a grumpy mood, and I already have a headache. Why egg it on a little bit more? So, I wait. And about 11.35, I'm like, hey, uh, when are you going to come over? I was told, oh, I get off at 12.30. Well, that's kind of funny because your schedule hasn't changed in quite a while, but okay, I'll believe this. Keep in mind, this person can't tell a true story if he wanted to, but whatever, right? So I wait, and I wait, and by this time I'm already awake, so I can't go back to sleep. So 12.30 comes around, 12.45 comes around. Where is this guy? Oh, um, yeah, he went home to go sleep because he was tired. So here I am, lack of sleep, with a massive headache. I need to go to work soon. I'm really pissed off. Not really pissed off, because I don't get really pissed off. And I'm in shock that he did this yet again to me. I... I he didn't do it to me. He did it to, I did it to myself because I believed in him. I believed in humanity. I believed that there is some common decency out there that will take somebody else's time into effect. And I, I, I'm just blown away. His work is less than five minutes away from my house. His house is on the other side of the city. In fact, I could show you where about he lives. See, by those mountains, those are the ochre mountains. That's approximately where his work is. See those mountains clear over there? That's right behind me? Those are the Wasatch Mountains. He lives on those. He lives, cl he works close to those. So he had to drive almost 20, 25 minutes to get home. He could have just drove those over, dropped them in the mailbox, set him on my way and dropped him over, it would have taken him three minutes and then he could have gone home. Common courtesy goes a long freaking way. Seriously. Now I'm at work. Oh, and that's not even it. I went to a doctor appointment. I was late because I was waiting for him. So of course I was late. They backed up my appointment and therefore they charged me because I was late because that's the latest thing that they're doing. If you're late for a doctor's appointment, they'll either charge you for being late or you can reschedule and you get charged for being rescheduled. Gotta love that, right? So not only was I charged $10 for being late, then they backed up my schedule so I can get my full appointment in. And that's why I'm late for work because I was late for my doctor's appointment. But don't worry, he said he'd bring it to work. Jackass. I'll see you the day after tomorrow's yesterday.